Why do you paint still lifes? People sometimes ask me. Figures are sexy and landscapes take you someplace, they say. Well, still life is personal. Every painting I make is a journal entry. It's a glimpse into my life. This Pantone mug alludes to my career in advertising and this tea I order from London. That's my favorite place. But you don't need to know any of that to enjoy it because I'm trying to make interesting arrangements of colors and shapes that engage you. I'm one of those lifelong student types, I guess. I read as widely as I can and I'm a popular culture vulture. I always wanted to learn how to paint and I've looked at so much great art in museums and galleries that it's quite humbling to even attempt to add to what already exists. But everyone has their own perspective on the world, their own angle, and I have mine and I want to share it with people. I told a friend that I was learning to paint and he said, no, flip it around, paint to learn. That was a gift that's opened a whole new way of life for me. So all these two-dimensional illusions represent objects from my world that I'm choosing to share with you. I want to make you smile or make you think. The novelist Henry James once said, be one on whom nothing is lost. That's who I want to be. That's why I paint still lifes, to see what I'm looking at.